Hey, how's it going everybody? It's KB here. So in this video, I'm going to show you the new Android 9 Pi emulator for Windows PC and also for the Linux PC. Just in case if you don't use the Windows and you have the Linux PC. So first of all, we will get into how to download and after that we will start the emulator. So to download, first of all, you have to visit this site and don't worry, I will put all the required links in the description you can go there and click on them and visit the site once you visit the site uh, you can see here full android pi emulator for pc you can read the description about it and you can also see the introduction video if you want to so before you download the simulator you should read the instructions for the simulator how to install and how to do that you know all that kind of stuff you can do in emulator or a in an android phone so it's basically a android phone in your pc so we are at the download section here right here so you can see full android pi emulator for windows pc we can click on it and download the emulator for our windows pc but if you have a linux you can download the linux version of this emulator so to download you just click on it and it will open the mega.nz this is a cloud storage from here you can just download the full android pi emulator for your pc and i have already downloaded it. it's a zip file you just have to unzip it i have already unzipped it so i'm just gonna open the folder which i extracted now first thing i forgot to mention that this will only work with the intel cpu so if you have a amd cpu in your pc it will not work do not try it will never work so if you have an intel good and make sure that you have a decent intel cpu to you know make this emulator at least work because if you have a really old intel cpu it might not work and to play heavy games all that kind of stuff you may need a really good pc now you just have to click on this start emulator dot bat so i'm just gonna double click on it and now it should start the emulator and it will also open the command prompt like that you just keep it minimized because that's not the emulator the emulator is actually loading right now so another thing you have to keep in mind that you should not close this window you just keep it minimize and if you're booting this for the first time it might take some time i have already started this and i have downloaded a few games and apps you can see here i have downloaded the clash royale whatsapp and i have also set up the google play store so i can download the games and apps cool right so just to show you guys that this is a uh, Android 9 I'm just gonna show you in about phone where is that okay about emulated device so you can see here Android come on Android 9 Pi now let's go into the Play Store and check what we can download and what we cannot so you can see here we have some applications we can download all of them uh, I have one problem with this simulator that I can't download the PUBG from the Play Store but if you are an average Android user I'm sure you know how to download the PUBG outside of the Play Store you can download the PUBG from you know any website and play so I don't know why but it's not showing up right here in Play Store but it should work because it's Android 9 Pi and uh, yeah as you can see asphalt is showing up here it's a 2.1 gigabyte heavy game and it's working you can just download it and have fun with it you can see even in the uh, introduction video of this android emulator they played pubg on it so pubg share works so now let's test this game which i have downloaded uh, clash royale no one plays this i know that but you know just to show you guys this fairly works not fairly it works flawlessly it's smooth it's fast let me show you okay i can drop that i feel no lag you know if you want to do a heavy gaming i'm sure that you will need a really good pc for that so 
I'm just going to rotate this. Thankfully that we have the rotate button, otherwise we would be in trouble. So let's say you are a WhatsApp user. Let's see if it works. You, are, you have a custom room installed. Custom rooms can cause problems. Okay, blah, 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 agree and accept. And you can see WhatsApp works. So I can say that you can use this as a Android phone in your PC if you have a decent PC. If you have a powerful PC, it will be great. You know what I mean. So you will need a good PC to run the simulator and play some heavy games. So let's revisit the side of the simulator so I can show you a few things. Uh, let's say you want to root. As I said earlier, if you want to root, you can click on this link here and download the Magisk Manager APK and install it and root will start working and uh, after that let's say this thing you can't maximize it you can go full screen in the simulator but if you download the what is the name of that thing i forgot yeah so if you want to go full screen in the simulator you can see put the android emulator in full screen with borderless gaming so there is actually one application for Windows, software for Windows, which lets any application to be in full screen. So you can download this and make the simulator in full screen and play the game or play with the application in full screen just like you do in your phone. So that's the way to make the simulator in full screen. And I think I'm done here. So this is an Android Pi emulator for your PC and you can do whatever you want to do. I think that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, comment and subscribe. And I will put link in the description for uh, the website for the emulator. You can go there and download the emulator and have fun. I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.